on WETT Waterfront Radio. Broadcasting from the top of the Sky Tower, it's time for your VIP view. As you take your ride up to a height of 300 feet, I thought it would be fun to share some of my SeaWorld secrets that might help to make your day even more exciting. Oh, for your own safety, please stay in your seats for the entire ride, and no smoking, please. SeaWorld is known for world-class aquarium collections of strange and unusual marine creatures. Believe it or not, you can find some unique aquariums at the gift shop of Journey to Atlantis, where sharks circle above you and schools of fish swim around your feet. SeaWorld has a history of fun-filled shows, but the excitement usually starts before the show even begins. Be sure to arrive about 30 minutes early to each show, not only to get a good seat, but also to experience bonus surprises that many guests miss. For example, if you've never seen the Sea Lion and Otter show, get there early. Trust me, it's worth it. Well, we're just about 300 feet up now, and from here you can see for miles and miles. As the cabin rotates, keep an eye open for the lush tropical oasis right across the street from SeaWorld. That's Discovery Cove. You might have heard of it. If not, here's the inside story. At Discovery Cove, you can spend a leisurely day snorkeling with rays and exotic fish, exploring a spectacular tropical bird habitat, relaxing on a beautiful beach with a cool drink, and even swimming alongside dolphins. See something new to the east? Located right across the street is Aquatica, SeaWorld's all-new water park. Look for our signature ride, two awesome and close tube slides that send you speeding through a lively lagoon filled with playful, cumbersome dolphins. Connect with the ocean's creatures right through the sea world. Then play along the waves of Aquatica. It's a water park it's only nice. sea world can create. Visit the information counter today to see how you can experience yeah, see the bungee jump thing. Yeah, we'll see our bungee jump, so that's probably our whole Throughout SeaWorld, there are opportunities to feed not only you and your family, but various marine animals as well. You can hand feed stingrays at Key West and toss fish to sea lions at Pacific Point Preserve. Of course, it's a dream come true for both young and old to feed a dolphin. Well, the feeding times at the Key West Dolphin Cove are posted every day. Also, did you know that there's a secret underwater viewing area at the Key West Dolphin Attraction? It's a little known, don't miss part of SeaWorld. Interaction is a big part of a SeaWorld adventure, and there are several ways to make a once-in-a-lifetime animal connection. For example, scary thrills await at our shark encounter, where you can sign up for the shark deep dive. Imagine getting in a cage, underwater, surrounded by ominous sharks. Whoa, a stern and drill and rush like that. I recommend unwinding at one of Orlando's least known, unique dining experiences, Sharks Underwater Grill. For more information about any of the guided tours, educational programs, or restaurant reservations, just stop by the guest information counter near the front of the SeaWorld entrance gates. It said at the beginning, it's a new attraction. I can't remember the name now. When guests visit SeaWorld, they usually make a point to see the many exciting shows. Well, there's a hidden gem that I highly recommend. Stop by the air-conditioned Nautilus Theater to experience Odyssey. Also, for a taste of the Pacific, one of the best-kept secrets in Orlando is SeaWorld's fantastic Makahiki Luau Dinner Show. Set off on a journey of discovery filled with action both above and under the water. Blue Horizon is an extravaganza of grace and power that's unlike anything you've ever seen. 
people need to get there early for a good seat. Well, I hope you've enjoyed Captain Max's spy glass on SeaWorld aboard the Sky Tower. Thanks for joining us today. Be sure to check your seats for any belongings and watch your step as you exit the cabin. Once again, this is Captain Max Benneker on WETT Waterfront Radio, sharing a few of my SeaWorld secrets. Stay fair wind.